My name is Tom Caggiano. I'm head of school at Gems World Academy in Chicago. So we are a relatively new school in Chicago, pre-K through 12, independent, private school, um, and we're based in Lake Shore so we educate kids in, in a private education setting. I think the biggest challenge for me as a new leader, new head of school coming in, is the fact that the school is pretty young, uh, and I am the fourth head of the school in five years. So there's been turnover at the leadership level. So really, uh, the challenge is to try to settle things down. The other part of this is the fact that I think given all the turnover, um, there's been a little bit of, I think, a lack of accountability in some ways. Uh, and one of the things that I think teachers really pride themselves on, especially in an independent school setting, is this idea of teacher autonomy. And I think we've done the autonomy piece really, really well, but we haven't probably put in enough in the way of guardrails to kind of keep people, uh, keep the program consistent from teacher to, to teacher year to year. So that's one of the things that we've been working on, and that represents a pretty significant cultural shift for our faculty. So trying to explain the need to do this, and it really gets down to kind of the quality of the product and what we're promising and actually delivering on that, and yet at the same time not um, impinging too much on that autonomy, which is really something that, that independent school teachers especially really value, this kind of the balancing that we do. Whenever you go into a new environment, a new context, to make sure that, that I do my own kind of due diligence in terms of really understanding the culture, the people, uh, we've got lots of dis different constituencies. We have teachers, we have kids, we have families, and trying to understand as well as I can uh, the complexity of that community, but also what the prevailing cultural values are. And, and then I think understanding that and then trying to get everybody aligned around a mission uh, and, and agree to that uh, and get us moving in one kind of consistent direction, pulling in the same direction, is, is one of the big challenges. And that's really hard. It's sometimes like herding cats, but I think continued articulation of that mission and conversations and openness and transparency really helps kind of establish that foundation that allows you to do that. Um, it's, it's great to celebrate the successes that you have and they can kind of show themselves on any given day in any different way. Um, but then you usually you're gonna, that will be followed up by something that isn't so great. So we, I've tried to make sure that I don't get too high or too excited when something good is happening, even if it's a, a trend that's happening. Because I know that something, um, something that will take us in the other direction or challenge it is going to be something that we have to deal with that isn't as pleasant or exciting or is maybe on the negative side of things uh, is important too. So it's really, really trying to carve out that, that balance and, a, and kind of a, a neutral path emotionally forward I think allows you to, to be smart about things, um, to be I think good in your job every day because again, you're kind of you're taking a long view of the management part of it. Uh, you're able to react quickly, um, but you're not, the emotions are kind of taken out of it. I think a, a key indicator for, for us as a school that is functioning like a business is to, to really, and, and, and I think this is particularly unique in a school setting, uh, we have lots of people with very, very strong opinions about how to do things. We have lots of people who, uh, particularly our faculty, who might have uh, variable philosophies about pedagogy and how to teach. And I think, again, making sure that we're all kind of pulling in the same direction, that, that the overarching goal and mission of the school is one that we can all articulate and subscribe to, allows us to, to disagree with each other in some ways, but, but at the end of the day to kind of realize that we are on a team that we're all kind of doing what we can to advance the mission of the school to make the experience better for our kids and for our families.